Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy, back with our new camp of the week, and this time we're checking out Gambit's camp. This camp has quite a few things going for it, but the first thing I noticed was his trailer is hooked to a truck. And while yes, it's not sitting level on the ground, I don't care. He hooked his trailer to a vehicle, and you almost never see anybody do that. Of course, on the side of the trailer, it says Traveling Band, and it's got a bunch of instruments in the back. Fun little side note. After recording, we all hung out there playing some music and taking some pictures. Now over to his main little living area. You can see that he's living the Appalachian dream with a white picket fence and a camper. Plenty of Atomic Shop items on display throughout his camp. And who could blame him? There's some cool stuff in there from time to time. One cool thing I did notice while inside his camper was it, it gave me an opportunity to see how a weapon uh, wall display reacts when you try to put it inside a camper. Where it kind of hides the background a little bit on some of it. And it really made me wish that we could just hide the background of it altogether. Now he does have a few other displays throughout his camp. Of course right there he's got his frog just chilling with the teddy bear and the Mr. Fuzzy. Overall inside of the camper looking real good. Continue checking out the stuff outside. We've got the fancy grill. One of his workbenches. And then back there you can get a drink. And if I recall correctly it is full of Nuka Shine. So you get drunk from that. There's no telling where you'll end up. Overall, pretty cool. Now we'll work our way down. I really like how he got to use the railing as part of a, his friend's welcome sign. Of course, that whole area down the middle is full of crops, protected by turrets. Now over here, this is more of a shop type area. A little bit more on display. Of course, he's got his vending machines. They're almost a must-have in the wasteland. And this, right here. The Mr. Fuzzy ride with the bunny rabbit riding it. It's super cool. I was tempted to ride the Mr. Fuzzy, but I figured that might be a little bit rude pushing the bunny rabbit out the way. Of course, he's got a bunch of bobbleheads on display. And he's using the foundation trick to protect his extractor. Solid strategy. Now we'll work our way around. Where he's got a couple of water purifiers. And then hidden out in the back is his outhouse. Which is a must have. And I'm telling you, it never gets old seeing that mole rat pop out of the toilet. It's freaking cool. And then back here. Leads to the underground. And he told me I was the first person that noticed the underground part of his camp. So that's kind of special. Of course, if anybody would, would notice it, it would be Decoy. And down here, there's not a ton going on. A little bit more living space, some workbenches. You know, keeping things protected from the riffraff of the wasteland. Uh, you know, no matter how many times I've been under the map... I just love the look uh, of getting to see it. It looks all glitchy and wonky to some people, but it looks freaking amazing to me. It's a really cool thing to get to check out. Now, that mostly wraps up his camp, but there is one other little thing that I noticed. And that's his table over here. I'm just looking at it, it is really well lined up. I mean... Am I insane? I could have swore these things didn't snap together, but I'm looking at it, and it looks amazingly well lined up. In fact, I think after I'm done with this video, I'm going to have to go back in and see if those things snap, because I'm pretty sure they don't. And that was some perfect lining up on some tables. And that wraps up the tour of his camp. Huge thank you to Gambit for letting me check it out and share it with all of you. Now for the rest of you, if you've got a camp that you want shown in Camp of the Week, it's real simple. 
One, you have to be on Xbox. I'm sorry, I can't help anybody else out. Only Xbox. Two, hop down in the comments, give me your gamer tag. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later!